Only a handful of long-term care facilities in Trumbull County have reported positive COVID-19 cases among their residents or staff, but we learned a large amount of PPEs were delivered to nursing homes and other similar health care facilities to help protect everyone. First News reporting to Dean Grimley has that story tonight. Officials at Trumbull County's Emergency Operations Center are doing what they can to help slow the spread of COVID-19 at long-term care facilities. This is the most material, most PPE that we've pushed out uh, in one day uh, over the last four or five weeks. Late last week, the EOC received seven pallets of PPE from the State Emergency Management Agency. All of it is going to nursing homes and other health care extended and congregate living facilities. It's a high risk area, so uh, making sure that the workers there, uh, the individuals that are in and out there, um, you know, delivering the services at those facilities, they've got to have the PPE. Vizetta Fire Chief Dennis Lewis is in charge of logistics at the EOC. He says most of the county's previous PPE shipments from the state national stockpile were also given to those entities. I know it seemed bad, but we didn't have the supplies to give them. Now that we have it, we are really helping them out with giving uh, all these supplies, PPE to the nursing homes. Today, the materials were picked up by folks at the Trumbull Neighborhood Partnership. Just trying to get supplies to where they need to go. And delivered to more than a dozen nursing homes, including O'Brien Memorial, which according to the State Department of Health as of Thursday had 16 residents in the facility with COVID-19, the most recorded at any one facility in the county so far. I feel like it's somewhat of a responsibility. I'm healthy for the most part, so if I can get out and help people out, then all the better. In Majorie Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.